Hello guys hope you are alright. Today we are going to study the working mechanism of Thermas flask. Before we dive into understanding it, we need to understand how heat is lost from the body. Heat is lost from a body by conduction, convection, and radiation. For example, if we touch something heat flows into our body, it is due to conduction. In other hand, convection can happen, without direct contact, for example when you are sitting near a heater, you start feeling warm, this is due to convection. Radiation is slightly different from conduction and convection. For example heat travels from sun to earth through radiation. For simple understanding, let's take a look at the coffee on the table, heat is lost in the contact with the table it is conduction. Heat is traveling in air it is due to convection, and similarly due to radiation. A thermos flask consists of screw on stopper, outside stainless steel case, outside layer of glass coated with reflective material, and inner layer of glass. Now let's take a look at body of thermos. This is the innermost layer of thermos. It is made up of glass. The liquid in the thermos is stored in this layer. It is also the smallest layer of thermos. This is outer glass coated with reflective material. The reflective material prevents from radiation loss of heat by reflecting it straight back. There is a vacuum between first and second glass layer, which prevents from conduction. If you like our video then, consider subscribing our channel.